In my recent video explaining everything that you need to know about the 9 euro transport ticket, it turns out that I didn't explain everything that you need to know. Because after I made it, a story emerged about a small detail that I missed, which is likely to cause quite a lot of problems. I explained that the ticket is valid on local trains, meaning RB, RE and MEX trains, and I forgot to mention by the way also IRE trains. Now that is still true. The problem is that not all trains that have RE numbers are in fact RE trains. They are not part of the local public transport network and therefore you can't use the 9 euro ticket on them. Deutsche Bahn has two subsidiaries operating the trains. DB Fernverkehr is responsible for long distance trains which are not covered by the 9 euro ticket. Local trains are operated by DB Regio which in turn is divided into seven regional companies and those trains are covered by the 9 euro ticket. The problem is that there are seven routes on which DB Fernverkehr runs intercity trains which can, for at least some portions of their respective routes, be used with local public transport tickets. And so these trains, as well as having the normal IC numbers, are also given RE numbers. The routes in question are these. Bremen to Norddeichmole, Elsterwerda to Berlin, Prenzlau to Berlin, Potsdam to Cottbus, Dillenburg to Lettmarte, Erfurt to Gera and Stuttgart to Konstanz. And starting on June the 12th there will be an 8th Chemnitz to Dresden. On these routes long distance intercity trains can be used as if they were RE trains. For example, here are the details of a train from Bremen to Norddeich. You can very clearly see that it has two numbers, one as an intercity train and one as a regional express train. But that's not the awful part. The awful part is this bit which says that the 9 euro ticket is not valid on this train. The exception to this is the Stuttgart to Konstanz lines where these combined ICRE trains can be used with the 9 euro ticket. How is this possible? Because Deutsche Bahn has reached an agreement with the state of Baden-Württemberg. See, these trains are not being run by DB Regio, which is being compensated for loss of revenue from ticket sales, but by DB Fernverkehr, which is not being compensated. And this has led to an argument between Deutsche Bahn and the state governments, which goes like this. Look, if you want the 9 euro ticket to be valid on our intercity trains, you will have to pay us. But we are paying you. No, you're only paying one of our subsidiaries, but it's not the one that is operating these trains. Look, this is ridiculous. You're just splitting hairs for the purpose of being greedy. You should be happy to get all of these extra passengers. No, that's not how this works. This is your idea. We shouldn't have to pay for your ideas. And so on and so on and so on and so on. It remains to be seen whether this issue can be resolved, but as I film this, you can use the 9 euro ticket on RB and RE trains except those RE trains that are also IC trains unless you're in Baden-Württemberg. The rule of thumb is that any train that is white with a red stripe, like this one, cannot be used with the 9 euro ticket, but this rule does not apply in Baden-Württemberg. And it is possible, who knows, that by the time you get to see this video, other states may have been able to come to a similar agreement. And what do we learn from all of this? Well, lots of things, but to any politicians who are watching, I would say the following. This is exactly why you never announce a major initiative like this before you have worked out all of the details. And if you didn't see my previous video explaining everything else you need to know, then I've linked to it down there. And to everybody planning to use the 9 euro ticket, Good luck. <laughs>